Hey guys, welcome back. So today I had an excellent question by a fellow user here uh, on Shaper 3D and he said, how do I make this edge connected? So the easiest way would be to, to use the extrude tool to extrude it, make it a union piece and then replace the face of the edges here. And th this is basically the simplest way unless you have something crazy going on. Uh, however, I know that some of you have uh, some kind of weird edge or something. So let me show you a workaround uh, that you can use kind of like surface modeling, but with the translate tool. So in this case, we go ahead and sketch across the lines here uh, as separate pieces. Then we go ahead and extrude those sketches. We could do two here. Make sure it's a new body because it's on the back plate there. Then extrude this as a new body. And then so what we do next is replace the face piece of cake, right? Replace the second face, walk in the park, right? And then for the third face, we replace it, but guess what? We have some issues. This is where the translate tool comes in handy. We go ahead and choose the translate tool. We select that fi fine edge right there, not the whole shape. And we translate from edge to edge, and we're done, right? No, we have one more edge. Let's go ahead and use the translate tool one more time. Select that edge now, instead of the line one on the bottom, and we move that. And now we have our final piece. And I hope you guys learned something. Hopefully this is a useful trick for you in the future. I'll see you guys in the next one. Here at J Lake 3 d our goal is to inspire and empower you to create your own amazing projects. Please support our work so that we can keep doing it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to see more.